Welcome to today's video. Today, you guys are gonna come along with me reading my first ever arc, The One and Only Mold My Future by Emmy Bella. The author's watching. Thank you so, so much for giving me the opportunity reading your book before I release. Release date is August 27th. So if you guys are really, really interested in this book, make sure you guys get your hands on this and start reading. If you guys have a Kindle and you search up Mold My Future, it will pop up as Kindle Limited. I was gonna come along with me with my thoughts, reactions, and final thoughts with this whole whole book this is the author's first ever debut the email on august 6th or 7th and that's when i started reading the pdf author's instagram so you guys can follow her if you guys are interested on in keeping up with her i'm going to read the little like main points well interracial romance she's mexican he's italian we have um an entrepreneur and ceo we have a millionaire romance he falls first Latino representation, dual POV, no third at breakup, insta love, and strangers to friends to lovers. If you guys are interested in any of those, this book is for you and you should take the time to read it. Really, really proud of the author for the effort um, to do this. Rosie or Rosita, that's the main character's name. She is an entrepreneur. She has her own crochet shop. She just helps with the community and helps to earth. And it's just like so inspiring to read. And I really love our main character and she's literally the definition of girl balls she had like no time for love she was always working if we had to go in zodiac signs with that i believe she is a capricorn so that's our main character that we're following and our love interest is victor he is the ceo of this big huge company though it seems impossible when something begins to fall apart just as he stumbles into her life let's get on to the reading vlog all right guys so i officially got the arc of mold my future by amy bella i am so excited this is gonna be my first art. Today's August 6th. So the only problem that I have, I think it's just a me problem because it's my first time having an arc and like this whole experience. It's a learning experience. So you guys are gonna go along with me. I'm downloading it on my Kindle. Get my new stickers for August. See, I tried downloading it. As you can see, they have like two copies. I got the email this morning at 5 a.m. I literally tried two times. I'm assuming like arcs are like this way. They're not like the normal this way. As you can see, I they're all of the words are like jumbled up together and I don't know why. I don't I don't know how to fix it. I that's why I tried downloading it two times. I thought it was just the first few pages or every page of the book, so I'm I'm like worried. I was like, did I not download it right? I don't know. I think it's just a me problem. The author, this is her first debut and she worked very hard for this. But I was like, you know what? I'm just gonna read it on my phone. It's around like 300 ish pages. This is actually on my top of my TV arc. Super excited to read this arc. This is my first ever arc. And I'm going to buy the physical book and put a whole little display on my shelf because I applied with so many arcs and I did not get any of them. But this one's the first one that actually like came back to me and gave me an email and super, super grateful and appreciated of this. Oh my God. So so far i'm on page five yeah so we have the main character rosie or rosita has a business it is a yarn shop and she wants to make ceramics and art so like i love art that's all i have read so far i'm gonna continue reading today you guys are gonna come along with me to the journey look at my harry potter tote bag isn't it cute i got her at barnes for an update on page 256 on oh, chapter 31 actually really enjoyed it in the beginning i was trying to get used to her writing it was like it was pretty easy and the, obviously the mexican representation i absolutely love and, she, and the love interest is a billionaire he's ceo of this company right we have like a few side characters now we're going to it got spicy there's something background stories with both of the main characters going on what they went through i feel like something else needs to be happening because i'm kind of losing a little bit interest like i don't know i don't know what it has to be something big 
or something like i kind of need like a plot twist like i'm kind of getting bored just a little bit <laughs> I just finished the book. It took me a while because I was pretty busy, but I was very, very determined to finish this art before the release date. I'm super, super grateful for this opportunity. So thank you again to the author if you're watching. Because I can't wait for your second book. I am getting my hands on that book and I'm getting my hands on the physical book. Once I have enough money to get the physical book, I'm going to do like a little display. Because amazing. I actually love the book. I was hooked in the very beginning. I love Rosie and I love her. She is the definition of girl boss. But yeah, you get like a little bit emotional and background story with both me characters of rosie and victor of what they went through um and plus the guy's a chef like literally victor's a chef and he was co they're cooking together and but i really entirely liked the whole book i love the mexican representation like literally it just warms my heart to see the nanas and family gatherings it just literally warmed my heart yeah and then there was like this little thing i was kind of worried about what was gonna happen but you have two simon characters and they also help rosie with their crochet shop it's just so heartwarming to have that little friendship and they're always helping her out the community and recycling and helping the earth and i just literally really enjoy that and how we should do that more i can't wait for the second book i'm not gonna say which book is gonna be coming out next because you will see once you finish the book once you get your hands on this book the only reason it wasn't exactly five star in the middle it was like it, it was kind of losing me interest like i wanted a plot twist to already happen but it happened a few pages after i feel like it would have got cut off like just like a little bit and then the plot twist would like be like boom and i'm like oh gotta keep reading gotta keep reading but other than that it was really really good and my final rating for this is four stars so if you guys are interested in billionaire romance mexican representation and he's italian a girl boss read this book i entirely enjoy it it is free on kindle unlimited if you have done kindle and get your hands on this book yeah i'll see you guys in my next video thank you guys so much for watching and i'll see you guys in my next one